Okay, so continuing to field more questions here for U.S. Simili. Student is asking me if sometimes the NBME exams will under or over predict scores, okay? And then goes on to talk about in a long paragraph about different stuff that he read on Reddit, okay? This tends to be like the new activity that people engage in, that every little fucking thing they read on Reddit, they internalize and take to heart, okay? So I, in this short clip, will uh, quell myths about NBMEs under slash over predicting, okay? Are they accurate in terms of assessing your score and how accurate are they, all right? So before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Help grow this channel. Share with one of your friends prepping for US Millie. Help bring awareness to this channel. Hit the like button. Hit the bell if you want notifications. Find me on Instagram at melman underscore medical, M-E-H-L-M-A-N underscore medical. Link is down below. And find me on Telegram. Recently created a Telegram group and channel. The links are down below. Now, let's address the fucking question as far as do the NBME exams under slash over predict sometimes and to what extent? And the answer is unequivocally no, they never under predict, nor do they ever over predict. That's going to get some students real fucking heated and emotional right now, okay? Because you might say, well, I actually, I'm studying for step two. When I sat the step one, I had, you know, these two NBMEs that under predicted me, these two NBMEs that over predicted me. Relax, okay? You need to recognize that scores will fluctuate. It's the average of the NBMEs that matters. If you take, let's say, three NBMEs, that's 600 questions, and you just mix those questions in different random allotments, your scores will be different. That's just the nature of it. But if you sit, let's say, NBME 28 for step one, I'm just choosing a random NBME, NBME 30, or you're sitting step two, you sit NBME 11 versus nine, your scores on whichever exam you sit would be your real USMLE score had that been your USMLE today, okay? The questions are exactly the same as the real deal. They do not over predict. They do not under predict. People on Reddit tend to be real fucking loud when they have an outcome that is more on an extremity, okay? People are not posting continuously about how their NBMEs are exactly uh, what predicted or sorry, that their NBMEs predicted their real deal perfectly, okay? You're going to hear more uh, loudly from people on the extremities, okay? But I'm just giving you some uh, conviction in the point that no, the NBMEs do not overpredict, nor do they underpredict. If you're getting shitty scores, unfortunately, you do have to really assiduously review that NBME content. If you get a score that's really high, no, that's not an overprediction. That's actually genuinely your score. Don't think it's some sort of fluke. Like, you genuinely scored that, okay? I don't want to make this clip too long, but just recognize that there's going to be a spectrum regardless. If you arbitrarily take 20 people and they have their practice NBME scores, maybe you will get one person whose real deal, unfortunately, comes out a lot lower than their NBMEs. And one person out of fucking nowhere, gets a super fucking rocket high score that was way higher than their NBMEs. Everyone's like, OMG, crazy. Some dude on Reddit got X score. It happens, okay? So that's the point of this clip. The NBMEs are accurate. I'm going to continue making more content. You know the deal. If you like my stuff, subscribe to my channel. And I appreciate your time. That's it.